I'm talking with Matthew Postgate of the BBC at the Huawei mobile broadband event in London. Matthew, just taking part in a session on collaboration. What were some of the interesting aspects for you from the BBC perspective? Well, it's an interesting event because you had uh, organisations from across the whole value chain. And it's quite interesting to see the consensus around this project of us trying to bring mobile broadband and the information society you know, to life. And obviously from our perspective, we work with both handset manufacturers and network operators and of course the hardware providers that supply into those networks to try and create the services that audiences are going to value in this kind of new world. So being able to kind of talk to people from across that whole value chain about how we might collaborate to, to build that, that new future has been fantastic. And the BBC, well, at least in the UK, is, has produced an iconic solution, the BBC iPlayer. Um, where do you see the future for that in this uh, brave new world? Well, thank you. Um, BBC iPlayer has been a great success for us. And it, what it's really done is it's provided a lot more choice to audiences, so giving them the choice of what to watch, when and, and where. I'd see that continuing in the future, and, and we've recently announced plans to uh, extend the availability of content and also to start thinking about making content specifically for, for BBC iPlayer. I think one of the things that I'm interested in the context that we're speaking today is the, Im the rise of live uh, media within, within iPlayer. So this would be live television or live radio. Uh, and one of the things we're very keen is to see the 4G and LTE networks uh, deploy EMBMS in order to facilitate that use case. So I can see that as one of the other uh, evolutions of, of BBC iPlayer. Yeah, and I think with more mobile broadband itself, you're already looking at some new innovations, applications. Can you give us any sort of sneak preview of any of that? Yeah, I mean, absolutely. So uh, re this year, for example, we launched uh, a series of applications for uh, young audiences. So CBBS and CBBC are the children's t television brands that we have in in the UK, and they've been phenomenally successful. You know, those young audiences, for them, this is a very natural behavior. From our point of view, it's just a fantastically rich creative palette to, f to, to, to use to tell the stories and to have that kind of positive social impact that the BBC is trying to have with those, with those audiences. So I can see that continuing. Um, we also actually have been doing a lot of work in how mobile broadband might be used in production. So building on what we did last year with the Olympics, where we used 3G and 4G to uh, transmit uh, material back from the Olympic torch relay that travelled around the UK um, into some very kind of uh, inaccessible areas from a technology point of view. Um, we were able to do that through the enabling technologies that people at this, this event have, have put in place. And I think actually that impact in production is one of the other things that's going to have a, a big opportunity for the BBC in the future. Well, we'll watch that with interest and, and thanks for sharing your thoughts with us today. Thanks very much.